in the game. This is the day, this is the occasion. The final of the 2024 UEFA European Championship. A chance to write new history, a chance to achieve greatness, with the football world eagerly watching. The action is next on EA TV. And this is the game. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. I'm excited to be bringing you match day one action at the Euros. It's Portugal versus France. Well, it's vital that you don't have an off day in these group games. Consistency. Well, not one, Stuart, that's going to live long in the memory. Well, I think the manager might disagree, Derek. Any way you cut it, it's a wasted opportunity. Well, the 2016 European champions back in the final. No great surprise that Portugal are here. We've enjoyed their football over the course of the last few weeks and intriguing to see if they can get over the line on this the biggest occasion of them all and the good thing about portugal is they do have different game plans if they want to in this game they can sit deep and soak up pressure and then play on the counter-attack or they can be very creative when they get the ball in the top third of the field i'm not sure which tactic oh it's developing nicely for them here oh there's the goal there's the opener how about that
Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe. He hits the ball so cleanly. It's a fantastic strike. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Otavio. France being afforded too much space here. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. And the cross didn't beat the first man. Consistency is key to progressing further in the tournament. I'm looking forward to a hard-fought contest here today, Derek. Well, I'm not sure about you, Stuart, but I always think it's fascinating to... Ronaldo! There it is! The opening goal of this match, and what a start they've made! Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Rabiot. Now with Konate. Dembele on the ball. Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes, it's with Joao Cancelo. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? And stopping the danger. In a decent position now. Silva. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bernardo Silva. The ball with Ottavio. Now, who can he play it to? Oh, disappointing clearance. Well, well, if only he'd been able to stay onside. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Stay onside, and that could have been a really... And there goes the final whistle. Portugal have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment, but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserving champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing. And now, with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate, the trophy about to be presented. The European champions, Portugal! <laughs> what a great moment for these players. Absolutely brilliant. And it doesn't get any better than this, does it? A chance now to celebrate with their own fans. And the fans have also played their part. Just listen to the noise here. Great end to this tournament.
And there goes the final whistle. Well, they have to settle for a point each. At least both sides are on the board, Stuart. Well, it was a fairly even contest, but they now have to focus on getting three points in their next game. Otherwise, they'd be putting themselves...